Welcome to episode 23 of Nada Porcibly Orchids. It is mid-October now and near the end of the flowering season. Eddie is going to look around in his nursery to see what is left. Look at these bright orange flowers. Another nice one with large pink flowers and dark red lips. Eddie tried to breed with it but the pollens are not fertile. This green orchid has faded and turned yellow. Look at this beautiful dark pink, 14 to the stem and effect confirmation. Eddie has bred with it and the seedlings will flower next year. This is an old breeder that Eddie keeps for sentimental reasons. An interesting pale pink with an unusual lip. A lovely large white. A pity that the flowers are a bit crowded. Nonetheless, Eddie will use it to breed with a well-spaced white that his friend from New South Wales gave him. A stunning dark pink with a spectacular lip. Eddie is going to flower seedlings from it next year. A nice orange. A super round pink. A world class mid pink. Another nice pink. Not as good as the previous one. The other side of the same plant. A large yellow which needs some work on its ugly lip.
How is that for red? This is the parent of many of Eddie's orange seedlings. It is capable of carrying many spikes. The record is 13 spikes. Sorry this is a bit out of focus. A good pink but nothing to get too excited about. Look at the stunning lip of this one. These are absolutely the last spikes of the season. This is how Eddie stores his cutters, sharp edges facing up. The UV lights from the sun would help to keep them sterile. Of course, it would be even better if you store them in paper pouches. The newly planted seedlings are doing well. It is a sight to behold. The protocorns aren't doing much. Eddie decides to keep the lid off. We'll see what happens. These are the little plants that an interstate friend gave Eddie. The pieces of wire help to support them until the roots are established. Here are some well-established seed pots. Eddie is going to talk about his breeding program next time. Thank you for viewing and see you next time.